Assalamu alaikum. So this comment right here says, best advice for other Muslim sisters, and he means reverts, don't ever wed to an immigrant Muslim, just wed to an American Muslim. And this has to do with another post that I just did. Long story short, this revert sister got married to three immigrants, and they all did her bad, and they all left her, and this and that. And uh, she's talking about leaving Islam. And I see this as a perfect opportunity to speak about this because I've been a Muslim for 31 years and I've literally seen many times where women, revert w women, were dropped at the mosque. They've been divorced with their luggage and their kids as if they were puppies returned uh, to, to the pound when their husbands got sick of them. It's uh, no. I've heard the horror stories. I'm pretty sure that you have heard the horror stories or know people that this happened to personally. Okay, so why does it happen and how can we protect our newly converted Muslim sisters? First, the why. I think in my opinion that people do this, they prey upon new Muslim sisters because they're ignorant of the deen. And so a lot of people uh, take advantage of that. Number one vulnerability is the person that is preying upon this new revert sister. And I said, yeah, praying. Uh, knows that she doesn't have any family network. She doesn't have any type of support. Why? Because oftentimes us Muslims, us revert Muslims, we um, get disowned from our families. There's abuse uh, and a lifetime of support is just withdrawn right when you convert. She doesn't even have any brothers to say, uh, yeah, why are you even talking to my sister? And the guy knows that. That's why they do that. That's why they take advantage because there's no consequences. But what if that revert sister or that sister in general had about five big brothers that were into MMA and had her back? Totally different story. And you know what I mean? Big accountability. Send me location. If you are a sister and you just converted to Islam, please stop and listen to what I'm about to say. Don't marry. Stop, stop, stop. Just listen to me. Don't ever try to do this by yourself. Don't ever try to enter into a marriage contract or getting to know somebody unless you have a wali that's going to hold this guy who's trying to marry you accountable for his actions, how he approaches you, and what's your plan for the future. You do it any other way, and this guy is just going to game you and go straight to your heart. You know what I'm talking about. Lyrics, give me a break. Yeah, try that game on a big brother or baba. Roses are red and I'm about to turn your face blue. Am I saying that all immigrants are bad men and women? Absolutely not. I'm just saying that there's bad intentions on both sides, converts and born Muslims. American convert sisters, if you do not have a wadi, come and talk to another American that can hold the guy that you're talking to accountable.